I'm Liam and I make a tea out myself for general entertainment purposes. But I also direct and do camera work and a bit of everything. My name's David, I'm the actor slash writer slash director slash camera. Uh, I'm Stephen and I do a bit of directing. Uh, I'm also the writer and the producer. Uh, I'm Billy and I'm mainly the editor and camera op. I used to really enjoy watching films when I was younger and I like storytelling. I basically went to college because I wanted to go into journalism and I got there and I kind of got bored of journalism and I just started doing films. started focusing on that a bit more than everything else. Uh, I can actually pinpoint the exact YouTube video. It was um, by an old YouTuber. He's not active anymore, but I just took a lot of inspiration from it and continued making videos from there. I started off as a stage actor and once I'd gotten into college I decided that I was going to start working behind the scenes in films and stuff like that and I can work both behind and in front of the camera if I do this. So. Um, I've done a lot of stuff really, I've done documentary work, I've done fashion shows, I've done all sorts and I've done photography work as well so there's a lot of stuff in there. A lot of theatre. I've done music videos, I've done interviews with, with singers, bands, um, done a couple of self-projects and other uh, random festivals. Um, my previous work started on YouTube, it was just comedy skits and things like that and vlogs and then uh, I got involved with a company and did a few videos for them which ended up being shown at Buckingham Palace. Everything inspires me. Inspiration is a beautiful thing that you can use to make other things into beautiful things. I don't think anyone particularly inspires me, but just if I find a really good film, then I want to be able to make one that's as good as that. Uh, I'm going to go with Robert Downey Jr. I just think his, you know, how he came from such a, his father giving him drugs and him falling into this drugs path and then Coming out of it and being one of the biggest stars in Hollywood, it just shows that these, some people out there have got such determination and skill. And I want to be one of those people. No one really inspires me, I inspire myself. Pepsi. I don't give a shit. Usually mix the two together. Pepsi mix. That's a tough one. I watch many YouTubers. But yes, Nerd Cube. I don't have a favourite YouTuber, but I have like 50 favourite YouTubers. I just am a content poor. Cry. Cryotic. I like myself, even though I don't have any videos up. Knickers. I personally like folds. I think they're quite comfortable. No, boxes. Boxes, I don't own any briefs. See, this is a really big question for me, because if there were more superheroes around, I'd have empathy, which means I can just mimic the powers and keep them all the time. But if it was just general powers, I think I'd teleport. Teleport's not cool. Regeneration, I want to live forever. The power I want doesn't actually exist, which is to be able to think of a power and then activate and deactivate it whenever I want, but it doesn't exist, so uh, I think I'd definitely go for Hog Smash. I would have the human torches to power because I'd want to fly around as a ball of fire. I think I'd like Tony Stark's intelligence. I'd like to build a suit for myself. Mm -hmm.